Hello and welcome once again. I'm Louis Fernandez from the Louis R. Fernandez Group with Keller Williams, Cora Gables, and Coconut Grove Realty. It's time again for another update on the national real estate market trend and, of course, my backyard, Cora Gables. Let's look at the numbers, shall we? The March data on the U.S. housing market shows a growing optimism and confidence among potential sellers. Realtors.com March 2013 data indicates that while national housing inventory decreased 15.22% since last year, the number of listings increased 2.36 since February of 2013. This month-over-month -month increase indicates a willingness of sellers to put their property on the market. A price increase of the average listing of 0.05% indicate a national average price of single-family homes over $190,000. A little closer to home, statewide medium sale price in March increased 12.8% to $150,000 for single-family home and 21.1% to $115,000 for condominiums. This according to the National Association of Realtors. There are fewer distressed sales in South Florida. Strong demand for bank-owned REO and improved processing short sales continue to yield absorption of distressed listings and to contribute to price appreciation. In January, 42.2% of all closed residential sales in Miami-Dade County were distressed, including REOs and short sales, compared to 53.6% this time last year. And how about those cash buyers? They seem to be everywhere. Just alone in, in Miami-Dade County, 68% of all transactions closed in February were cash sales, 49% were single-family homes, and 78% were condominiums. 90%, and I repeat, 90% of foreign purchasers buy their property in cash. That continues to reflect the international market here in South Florida as compared nationally where less than one-third of all transactions are done in cash. And now to the graphs. In Coral Gables, sold properties by month, March 2012 versus March 2013, the number of sold properties is up by 4%. The median price in March ending $507,500. Average days on the market, 89 days. Bank owned, 12%. Privately owned, 87.7%. Under contract properties by month of March 2012 versus March 2013, the number of under contract properties is up 29%. The average days on market by month in Coral Gables, March 2012 versus March 2013, the average days on the market is down by 45%, which actually reflects a daytime of 72 days on the market. In the month of supply of inventory, again, since last year of March and, and March 2013, the average month supply of inventory is down by 49%. Well, that about wraps it up. For more information, you can download our app on iTunes, Louis R. Fernandez Group, and there you can find additional real estate market trends and information as well as do your own property searches. And by the way, if you think about selling, buying, or renting, let the professional team of Louis R. Fernandez Group meet with you with a private consultation so we can discuss your real estate needs. Remember, keep watching out for us because we're watching out for you and your property. Thanks again.